Good morning, YouTube. It's All Things Pretty. And yes, I know it's been a long time, but I'm back, at least for now. So um, I wanted to share with you a haul that I did from Tuesday morning and from the Goodwill. So as I was having my morning cup of coffee, and in case you're wondering, this mug came from Dollar Tree. I really love it because it's um, like embossed. It's really nice. But anyway, I was having my morning cup of coffee and I said, you know what? While you're watching videos, why don't you make a video? Why don't you manage your time better? So here I am. So when I went to Tuesday morning, I had no intentions on buying anything crafty. I was looking for something else. And, of course, I got sucked in, as usual. So, got some trees or something on my thing. Um, yeah, so let me get started with sharing what I got sucked into purchasing. So, they had these uh, Doris embossing folders. And I always struggle with making holiday cards. So, when I saw this, I was like, great, I can emboss a card. Or emboss a piece of paper, stick it on the card, run some ink over it, Merry Christmas, whatever. Easy for me. And I actually purchased um, these other holiday ones too. I thought she was cute. And then I really like this one, especially for kids. And this you could do like gift tags too to put on presents. So I thought that would be a cute idea. And then I am a sucker for a dress form. So I'll get that one and there. I love honeycombs. I don't know why, but I just do. I just think they're beautiful. And I don't have any of these sentiments, so I purchased that. I thought this was cute for her birthday or father's day for a boy and I really love feathers and I just love the um the prints in these feathers so that's my favorite and I don't know why I bought this one I mean it's cute but I'm not an avid drinker I guess that's what you say if you drink a lot I don't know I don't drink a lot but I know that wine seems to be the thing these days so I figured I might need to do something for I don't know, a party. Why not? It was 99 cents, I guess. That's the honest truth. It was cute and 99 cents, y'all. Then I got this watercolor pad. And if you've been following me on Instagram, all things pretty, go on over there and like my Instagram. Follow me. Um, watercolor has been one of the things that I've been experimenting and trying to teach myself how to do. So I bought these like postcards I figured it'd be cool to send them to my family and friends and you know pen pals and I have a watercolor stamp for the back so not a watercolor stamp a postcard stamp now I was on my way to Julian's and so this find was really right on time I was on my jo way to Julian's to get some canvas for a project that I'm working on and not canvas boards just um, canvas fabric and I ran across this package four sheets for 99 Let's see if I can get it focused there we go and it is 12 by 12 sheets of canvas and I thought that was perfect for what I'm trying to do and they had only four left so what does that mean y'all who can guess you guessed it I bought all four but then, but wait, there's more. Um, they had these. Sorry for the glare. These are the 12 and a quarter by 12 and a half self, um, the sealing bags, adhesive bags. So there's 12 in a pack for $2.99. So I bought the two packages of these that they had because I figured these go inside of this so if I was working on something um, to sell at a craft fair or if I wanted to sell on my Etsy I'd have a way to package them nicely so 
I bought those two. And then they had these 35 bags. And the size is, um, let's see if I can get it here. It's not wanting to focus, but it's five and seven eighths by four and a half for 99 cents. So these are self-sealing bags as well. Not self-sealing, but what's the word I want to use? I don't know. Adhesive bat? I guess that is. And then I bought these stencils for $1.99. And as you can see, the fabric. So I bought that. Then my next few items are from Goodwill. So a friend of mine who has traveled the world sent me some of his memorabilia and he wanted me to make him something to put that stuff in. So I found this really cool shadow box and it doesn't really fit in this video, but um, of course I'm not going to send it to him pink. So it's going to have a makeover, but this is the back and then it opens here. Um, and I'm going to change the fabric in the background. And I thought this was really cool. And it only cost me $3.16 from the Goodwill. So that is going to be for his project. Now, this next thing I really didn't need because I have one similar. Maybe the lower model, but you know how it is, y'all. And when you see the price, you'll see why I got it. See that? Create a sticker as I run 500. This is the big one up to five inch wide. $10.36. That was a deal to me because I think depending on where you go, I've seen them range from $25 to 40 bucks. It just depends on who it is. And then I purchased, they had one refill to go with it. And the refill was almost as much as the thing, but I think in the store the refill is much more expensive. So I think this was like $8 or $7 or something like that. And then last, we, oh no, I do have a couple of other things. Um, I don't know if this is going to fit in this video, but I'm going to try. This monstrosity is what it looks like from this view. But it's really not. I'm going to move this out of the way. It was a makeup case. And if I can get you open. I use it for my craft supplies. So hopefully you can see that. So my Derwent watercolor pencils, my aquarelle pencils, Derwent pencils. Down here I have my new Spectrum Aqua markers which I absolutely love and then I have some paint brushes and miscellaneous down here. But I got this for three bucks so I couldn't pass it up. So that's that. Now I'm going to take you over to my lovely new carpet and I don't want you to get dizzy so I'm going to block you. Bam, my new carpet, it's an area rug and I absolutely love it. And then I got the matching, well I won't say matching, but curtains to go with it. And I thought the tassels, the tassels really sucked me in y'all. It was all about the tassels. So yeah. So that is my haul, y'all, and it's been great being back for today. I hope to be back again um, and share some of the creative projects that I've done. Thank y'all for watching, and I'll talk to you soon.